everybody welcome to a new video in my course today we're gonna learn about the styling HTML directly okay let's say let's open for example Visual Studio Code and here we have a um, yeah, list yeah let's say that I want to make apple banana orange colored um, color to green for example or I want to change the font okay so this will be so hard because we will we will gonna repeat 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 a lot of times I mean that we will put the same com we'll write rewrite the same command for each one and like this like here so here we repeated the command but some it will be so it will might be so tricky why because for example here we put a mistake it will be so hard to find this mistake it will take a lot of time because you repeated it so today we'll we will learn how to use css okay so first thing all of them uses li yeah the selector li okay so we need to open a css and this css it will be linked to the HTML so we can what edit them okay so let's start okay so before we start we just need to link the HTML to CSS so the HTML will take the style rules from the CSS okay before we do this we need to make the CSS how we can do it create a new file for example let's name it by style.css okay and now go to the the where is it the HTML okay and before everything you need to use the head okay you need to use the head and open the head and write this command link brackets link space rel equal uh, quotation mark style sheet quotation mark space href equal a quotation mark and you can do it like this if okay and I have style not styles okay so you must be sure from the name of the file just this it will be for each one it will be different okay and B um, it's better to make it in the same folder that it HTML is in it okay because it's better than to write the full path okay so now now it's linked to check just we follow the link it open the CSS now what we're gonna do is uh, when I make a rule that will make for example the color blue okay so here in each one we have li so here we're gonna write sorry but I mean we will do it in HTML so here in HTML how we can do it so here we're gonna open style can open style and close it and click enter so here we have li so here we'll make li we'll open like this and write the color to be green or let's say blue and then we put here to separate from each one okay now let's go live and check our live server hooray we got it okay so let's for example change each one for example i want li to be color blue for example i want um li to okay to be for example font and uh, font size okay for example font size yeah this one and to for example to be um xx large okay so here for example I want the banana to be xx large so here I'm gonna write li2 okay and here the last thing I want to make for example the orange to be in orange color so for example I want to make li4 or let's change this to B. okay so here I want to write BA for banana 
okay so here I want to write OR means orange okay I'll open like this and here I'm gonna write the color I want the color to be orange because it's orange and we close like this and here change to OR and here OR I'm gonna go live again and we got it here that we make the banana to be like this and we made this to be like this but it is not as a list why because it is if you want to make it inside the ul you must use li so you might make just make them one we learn after how to make this okay but example you can make all the phone everything using font family in one style in one rule in one thing okay for example here li okay so i'm gonna open for example the font family font family and for example um um cambia okay and then i'm gonna refresh my page and i got it in this font okay so here how do i separate them using this one this symbol okay now here let's for example make also the for the example i want the Mm, example the font dash style I want it to be oblique okay so I'm gonna refresh and I got it like this okay so that was the lesson for today and see you in the next video